Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? My name is Jake, and welcome to another parallel editing tutorial brought to you by JK Bradley. That is me. Let's get into the tutorial. And as you can see by my composition name, we're doing the wiggle touch. Very simple. If I can ram preview for you right here, just, it's just wiggling. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Very easy. So uh, it's just got this nice, steady wiggle. This is good for cinematics. That's what I use it for. So let me just make this bit bigger for you guys. So it's wiggling and avid. I'm, re I'm ram previewing in quarter. That's why the quality like sucks. So there we go. So let's just delete that. We don't want that in there. Uh, we're just gonna drag this in here. Hmm. Yeah, that looks good. Nice, nice image. It's not even a moving thing. It's just a JPEG. So now we're going to get into the wiggle. So you just want to hit P on the clip that you want to wiggle. Uh, Alt click on the position and where it says transform position you want to delete that and then you want to type in wiggle W I G G L E open parentheses 2 comma 10 close parentheses do not hit enter and then uncheck that now as you can see it's wiggling just like this so if I ran preview it real quick you can see that it is indeed wiggling but we have these obnoxious black bars on the side we do not want those so we just want to simply hit S on our keyboard hit the scale let's change it to about 103 that'll make it bigger so we do not get the obnoxious black lines and there we have our wiggle if you guys want to know how to do the 3D text into a image like this refer to the compositing tutorial that I did on this channel uh, so yeah this is the wiggle tut hope you guys enjoyed it as always have a good life I guess peace out bye just just leave bye yep bye